So we're here today at Brunswick Hills Tennis Center. Uh, most folks in East Brunswick would recognize that as the tennis center that's on the southbound uh, border of East Brunswick Route 18 corridor. And we're here today as the uh, facility is under new management and uh, with a new directive and, and vision for how we're going to move tennis into East Brunswick in this 21st century economy that we're dealing with right now. And I have with us today both Todd and Dave who are co owners and I want them to give a little bit of an explanation about what's being done here, maybe the relationship with the tennis center down the street and uh, some of the services you offer, hours and, and uh, so that folks who might not be familiar with this facility um, can understand what it is you're looking to do here. Awesome. All right guys, I'm Todd um, and we are open uh, Monday through Friday from 6 to 11 and on the weekends from 6 to 9. Uh, we do have pretty much anything you could think of, you know, from ages three to adults. We have programming for beginners all the way up to advanced players. We have a partnership with the township to uh, help run the rec programs and feed kids into the outside programs as well as inside. Uh, this tennis facility, it is seven courts and we have six pickleball courts as well. Uh, where we have a lot of play in the community of pickleball players and uh, the nice thing about this is we have a, a gym so we do notice that a lot of the parents you know they're able to get a, an hour to relax they drop their kids off at tennis and they're able to work out you know in the gym which is very nice uh, to see you know it's one stop for all the family with the recreation department and, and the partnerships in the town you know, our, our tennis is, is growing. All racket sports are growing, you know what I mean? So we, we do have another facility up the street and, um, you know, this is just an expansion of that as well to be able to offer all the services. Um, if you want to play tennis, you know, we definitely have it here. We have a, a snack bar, we have a little coffee shop. Everyone seems to be enjoying it and, uh, you know, we're looking forward to continuing to offer everything that we have in the town, running summer programs, summer camps, high level tournaments here as well. Thank you, the mayor, council, uh, assemblyman, and everybody else that could come here today. Um, I think Todd covered the rest. especially in, in a state like ours, which is undergoing lots of change and um, seeing a lot of new people moving into the state that the nature of retail has changed. In order for us to really make 18 the vital corridor that we want it to be and for it to continue to be, it, it continues to move in the direction of services and recreation. So um, understanding that from now a state point of view, maybe we'd like the assemblyman to welcome you here as well and to talk a little bit about what he sees as the the future of recreation here in the state. Absolutely. Uh, thank you, Mayor. First of all, congratulations, Todd and Dave. Uh, this is, like they said, a great thing for East Brunswick. We have, uh, in a, this is also an additional, an added um, service incentive for all the residents of East Brunswick, all the neighboring towns also. And we are actually seeing uh, a collaboration and a, an extension of the, the old East Brunswick Tennis Club, which has been here forever. Mm -hmm. uh, it, it was there when I moved in. I used to live behind you guys for a long time. So it's great to see how this facility is now being reused again and repurposed. And and from the state point of view, you know, we've been doing a lot to bring uh, community services to the townships. Uh, like right, East Brunswick is right now in the, in, the, in, the, in the midst of building an ice rink for the community as well. And we're also redoing the whole Route 18 project so we have a better thoroughfare through the town. And I think that's gonna bring a lot more people here and you know, your business is going to definitely grow from that as well and we're looking to do a lot more we're trying to bring in a lot more money state money into the different towns for all, all the different uh, projects that's going on so looking forward to that congratulations welcome this really is an exciting day you know it's um it, it's something that's very obvious you know it's not just what the mayor was saying that you know we're, we're trying to uh, reinvent you know Route 18 in the corridor and and uh, you know uh, expand it from just a retail center to an entertainment quarter but it's something that's really just uh, the, the community is asking for I know Dave you come to me like a year ago we were talking about this and how uh, there's just that need here I think um, it's something that we really see uh, coming down our, our, our commercial corridor is this this growing entertainment industry and uh, watching um, businesses come anew here is wonderful but watching them expand and grow is just as good 
uh, congratulations to Dave and Todd for uh, giving us this venue to ribbon ceremony to honor your uh, dedication and commitment to our champions and strengthening our community even more so. And as much as uh, thank you to Mayor Cohen and Assemblyman uh, Stanley, because they were the first to invest in East Brunswick with the outdoor parks at Bicentennial Park, 2016 and 17, as I recall, opening that wonderful four courts. And then subsequently, we have opened uh, 14 courts of renovation, asphalt, concrete. So we are able to provide programs with East Brunswick Recreation. And Ryan Murphy is here to represent East Brunswick Recreation and parks, but also we have our U.S. Tennis Association um, community representative Andres Sanchez, who also has participated in Love Serving Daisy, which is our adaptive tennis program. As I have been a resident, but certainly a recipient of East Brunswick Recreation Tennis Instruction, in order to gain better experience, I've gone to the North Side Club, East Brunswick Racquet Club, and now Brunswick Hills Tennis Center, and it promoted me as a tennis champion to go nationally with leagues. And we have leagues in the morning since my breakfast of champions team, 30 plus people come 5.45 to 8 a.m. on Saturday morning. So we know that our compassion of good health and wellness for adults, but for our youth, and Furthermore, all these partnering with our township program is such a wonderful blessing after three decades of playing tennis. So I appreciate you welcoming you to our Chamber of Commerce, Thanks. as Todd is such a remarkable champion of sustainability. He has contributed his two clubs to 53,000 tennis balls saved from our East Brunswick landfill. I appreciate all that you do and really the remarkable collaboration really makes me feel so proud to be in East Brunswick. So come out to Brunswick Hills Tennis Center. That collaboration um, is represented here. Uh, Ryan represents our Parks and Recs Department, and I know that you've got a lot of work that you do together to try to help bring programs that we offer at the township and your business uh, together for the benefit of our residents. So. Uh, congratulations to you both on the new building. Uh, Recreation has done quite a lot with the Racquet Club in the past with our summer programs and now our year-round recreation programs. So we are just excited at the new opportunity this additional building can provide to us and all of our residents who participate.